Welcome, everyone, to the ultimate game in the college football season. Everything has built to this. The battle for the national championship and college football immortality. A moment that every young football player grows up dreaming about. And these two teams have survived the expanded playoff grind. They have battled through a regular season, multiple playoff victories, all sorts of challenges and adversity, and they've arrived at this moment to battle for that precious trophy. As we'll see the number six seed in this playoff, the Cincinnati Bearcats taking on a team from the Big Ten, the Oregon Ducks. For EA Sports College Football, I'm Chris Fowler, joined here as always by Kirk Herbstreit. Kirk, everything has been building to this. It's time for the national championship. Let's crown a champion. Keeping it on the ground here. A solid eight-yard gain brings up a second and two. Bearcats looking to run some tempo here. Boy, a nice call here to start this national championship game off with a physical run. I think this offensive line has been a strength all year long, and here they get this game started the right way. Offense right to the line, cranking up the tempo. Offense will keep it on the ground here. You know, in the era that we live in right now, everybody wants to spread the field around, try to create space, try to create one-on-one -on -one matchups, and the defense has countered over the years by trying to play out wide. But here's a great example of a defense. Has the ability to play wide, but still be solid at the line of scrimmage, not give up big run plays. Challenging spot for the offense. It's third down and long from the 45. Airing this one out toward the sideline. Clock near the goal line. And he scores! First play of the drive, they look to the right. The pickup is seven yards, not second and three. No huddle now for the offense. Hand off to the single back. Physical one, breaking tackles. An explosive play. They'll finally make the tackle down at the 27-yard line. The first and ten play come up for the offense. Looking to pass. It's King. Makes a quick grab. Tackle made after a nice pickup on the play. The Bearcats getting set for first and ten. That's another huge game for this guy. And I'll tell you what they're doing a good job of is moving him around. He's not aligning just from one spot where the defense has an idea of where he is to try to take him out of the game. They've moved him around, given him a chance to get some one-on-one -on -one matchups. Boy, is he taking advantage of that here in the first half of the national title. And they'll bring him down after just a short pickup. Crucial. Third down coming up in the red zone. Can he keep the drive? And he'll get there. Touchdown, Bearcats. And now they'll run it on the draw. They tackle him behind the line, a loss of four. Second down after that previous play. And he'll set up to throw. And he lofts it toward the left sideline. That deep shot is caught for a big game. Breaks clear, end zone ahead. And he takes it all the way to the end zone. Touchdown, Cincinnati. Well, this is how you start to get rolling. That's two touchdowns so far, and the more he gets fed, the more often he's going to cash in. And from the shotgun, an inside handoff exactly what you want to see as a play caller. You get positive yards to be able to kind of keep you on schedule as a play caller. That's all you can ask for. Good job up front and a nice run. The senior able to make the stop after a short game. Offense facing third and short approaching midfield. Can they convert here or will they face a tough fourth down decision? 
looking downfield. It's King. And the pass is dropped. Would have been a big game, but he couldn't hold on. Boy, Chris, what a hit there. One man in the backfield, and he'll get the football. Fights through the tackle. Looks like the Bearcats will come to the line to crank up the tempo. Quarterback looking to throw it on second down. And he's going to float this one to the right side. The catch is made for a huge pickup. Touchdown, Bearcats. Just ran away from the defense. Well, a touchdown to a wide open man for what was going on on the defensive side of it. Wow, what was the defense thinking here? You can't... Ready? First play of the drive, they come out throwing. Receiver makes the grab. They've got him after a seven-yard game, so second and three. Offense right to the line, playing with tempo now. He'll have to throw it here on second down, and he'll loft it to the end zone. This is an example of a quarterback and his offense just taking what the defense gives you. Not a huge play, but positive yards. The defense wants to give that throw to you. you take it, get the ball to your receiver, stay ahead of the sticks. And they'll run it out of the shotgun. And he moves the ball across midfield and picks up a first down. You know, offensive linemen are just a certain breed. They're always going to do their job, no matter who's back there carrying the ball. i tell you what, they have a little bit more confidence when the person that's carrying the ball can break off some big-time runs. That makes them block just a little bit harder, knowing what they're potentially capable of doing. They'll stop him behind the line for a loss of one. The offense won with the hurry-up. Back to throw. It's King. And he lofts it toward the sideline. Trying to go very deep there. Good effort. And now it's third down. They come to the line. A long way to go for the first down, but needing this crucial conversion right now. And he'll drop back here on third down. That one falls incomplete. They tried to press it deep, but now it brings up fourth down. Well, Chris, obviously... First play of the drive. Here's a shot toward the end zone. Tried to press the ball deep, but it's incomplete. That ball just seemed to sail on. You got to make sure to give your receiver a chance to be able to come down with a catch and bounce because in today's game, man, these receivers make catches like this all the time. And if you put the ball out of bounds, you're not going to give them that opportunity. Rolls right, trying to make something happen. They try a downfield shot. That's a good effort there. But now it's third down. Not going to be easy here. Backed up a long way to go for a first down. Drops back, looking to throw for it on third down. That one is incomplete. The defender was right there, and it brings up fourth down now. Hey, it's an incomplete. Looking out throwing here to start the drive. And it's incomplete and a very quick throw. Well, this quarterback and his receivers have got to get on the same page. They've got to find a rhythm if they want to move the ball down the field. Let's it go. It's picked off. He tried to fire the ball into a tight window. Not a big return, but the pick ends the scoring threat. The offense will now take over at the 30. play of the drive that come out throwing it's a quick grab so the offense calls a timeout here that's their first to the half there's a really great job here with the quarterback and the receiver this is all about timing 
quarterback gets back, no hitch in his delivery, gets the ball out in front of the receiver where he can run away from the defender. For oh, and he's in the clear now. It's a foot race. The offense will quickly spend a timeout here after the play. The offense comes back out there. Not much time left. Perhaps just time for a couple of plays before the half. And he's going to fling it deep, going for it all here. Makes the grab in the end zone. Touchdown, Cincinnati. Well, if you're going to give it to him, he's going to take it. That's his third. Off the play fake, looking to throw on first down. Trying to create outside the pocket now. Hit as he releases it, and the pass ball is incomplete. Good adjustment here by the defensive coordinator. Let's face it, it's been a tough game so far for this defense. They've given up a ton of yards and touchdowns through the air. This time they figured out a way to affect his timing, and they get the pressure to hit him before he can make another play. Dropping back, we're going to throw for the first down. The pass is off target. He got hit as he threw as the third down pressure works. But a defense picks the... Ball handed off. They'll stop him behind the line for a loss of one. The Bearcats will hustle to the line to run the hurry-up offense. Looking to pass. It's King. It's a deep throw down the right sideline. Deep ball is caught for a huge game here. A handoff to the back. Stop after a small game. Now look at it, second and nine. Offense in hurry up mode. Quarterback looking to pass here on second down. Let's it go on the move. Launching deep. Incomplete. They cannot connect on the deep ball. Now the offense facing a third and long from their own 41. You know, they don't hit this downfield, but it gives you an idea of how much pressure this quarterback can put on this defense. They've got to cover all these receivers, worry about the running game, try to pressure. Quarterback pulls the ball. It's a keeper. Got the first down. Now looking for more. They bring him down, but that's a solid gain on the play. First down and ten. Man, is he pretty to watch run this option. He is so dangerous with the threat to run or to throw. This time he keeps it himself, and you can see how much ground he eats up with that kind of speed. New set of downs to the offense. First and ten. Hey, you got to do what you got to do. You got to rely on that offensive line in the running game here to be able to secure a victory. Good call, and just keep working that clock. Quarterback adjusting now to the defense. Handoff as they try to work the clock here. They'll stop him behind the line for a loss of one. Offense cranking up the tempo now. No huddle. Boy, these obvious running situations are very tough when you're working with the lead late in the game because you know the defense is going to stack the line of scrimmage, make it as difficult as possible for you to run the football. So nice job there by the defense. They're trying to punch that ball out, do anything they can at all to get the ball back. Back to throw. It's King. And he'll loft this one deep to the left side. Clock way downfield for a huge game. Trying to flex the ground game here. Running back takes the handoff. They'll stop him behind the line for a loss of one. And now from the pistol formation. Takes the handoff again. The junior able to bring him down quickly. Chris, you know, the spread error over the years has always grown offensively. But I've been always impressed with defenses that really build their defense to play in space still have an ability to be sound at the line of scrimmage and defend a running game. It's exactly what we saw right here. Bearcats come off the line in a hurry-up. 
Yeah, I like this call here late in the game like this with the lead. Nothing too fancy. Just right up the middle. Trust that offensive line and this running back and just keep working that clock. No huddle here for the offense. Handoff heading left. Goes backwards, losing three yards there. Offense been in reverse here. Now a long way to go to convert this third down. Dropping back. Look at the throw for the first down. He lets it go. Pass is caught right near the sideline. What a catch. Does get the foot down. And the Bearcats starting a new series here on first and ten. Here's the handoff. And the defense able to hold him there to a short game. Coming to the line on second down. This is important. They want to avoid a third and long. And they'll use the ground game here. Well, the back just had nowhere to go. How about the defensive line? They eat up all the blocks up front, freeing those linebackers up to be able to make the play. Just a bad play all around for this offense. And the pass is incomplete just across the goal line. Boy, this is all about the defense here. Quarterback changing the play now at the line. Easy. Keep it on the ground. There's the handoff. They'll stop him behind the line for a loss of one. That's a great play all round by this defense. Your first level defenders hold their own at the point of attack, allowing the second and third level players to roam free and make the tackle close to the line of scrimmage. Give it to the back again. The pickup is just three yards. Now it's third down and seven. They come to the line. A long way to go for the first down, but needing this crucial conversion right now. That's it. It's official. We have our national champions. What an emphatic statement to close out this national championship run. You know, the coach told his guys, go out there and leave no doubt. The same mission accomplished. Well, sometimes a team wins a national championship and they just got hot at the right time. And there's other times when it's been clearly the best team in college football all year. To me, these guys have been right up there as the top team in college football, and it's very fitting that they not only win it, but they win it in grand fashion. Well, that's going to do it for us and wrap up another outstanding season of college football. For Kirk Grove Street, I'm Chris Fowler. This has been a presentation of EA Sports College Football. Officially, your kings of the college football world and national champions, the Cincinnati Bearcats.